Hello everybody! I know I don't normally start off on the screen, but I just wanted to show you guys. Look! Undertale! And there's Sans! And Undyne! And Papyrus! And actually, I think Undyne is standing on Papyrus's head. Yep, we last ended off at Tem Village, because I helped him get Cool Leg. Oh dear, I'm also mentioning people on Skype. Oh no, I'm in the waterfalls! Well, I'm near that area, at least. Um... Uh, I have forgot my intro. Hey, everybody's a heroic legend here. I'm sorry. I just want to point that. I, I like pointing things out first. Uh, I I believe I might be coming down with a uh, with possibly allergies myself. It runs in my family, so I wouldn't be too shocked if this was the year that I got allergies. Although I admit to not knowing how it works entirely because I haven't had to care about it. Well, I mean, I had to care because you know, other brother had it, and then he leaves. Wait. I didn't even see I was so busy trying to tell a story. Speaking of stories, holy hell, the things I've been watching on YouTube as of late. And the things I've been playing as of late. Tra la la, Timmy Village. The room before the Darkening Lantern Room. That's oddly specific, River Person. But what I wanted to say was part of the reason I didn't record last week was, um, I, well, I just plain forgot. Simply because I got Fire Emblem Fates, both Birthright and Conquest, and I had gotten Final Fantasy Explorers. So, that take, took up most of my time, and I, I fucking need to get a capture device for a, for my 3DS. Then all will be grand and glorious. Where the, of the man who came from another from the other world? Wait, what? What are you talking about, River Person? You just not gonna tell me? We'll have to come again because you're the only type of fast travel. Yes, yes, I remember. I just have to do a quick save here for just in case. I actually got a little bit confused at this first part. I was like, oh, what do you mean there's a lab? I don't see a lab. I will try and. You can't tell me what to do, game. It's you? <laughs> oh, I wish I had. Oh, I wish I had that gif to put. It's too dark to see. Why is it still too dark to see? It's really not that dark. Huh, magic. Oh, Jesus. I can't do an Alpha's voice, so I'm going to read this normally. I'm sorry. I just can't. Oh. My God. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... Um. <laughs> Hiya! I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's Royal Scientist. But, 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 uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. That's not creepy or stalkerish. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on the screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle. No problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti- anti-human combat features? Oh dear. Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so. And, um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with thirst for human blood? 
<laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. If anyone didn't see this coming, which you should if you play, I'm done with that joke. But if anyone didn't see this coming, I advise you to just, just really reconsider. Just whenever something hits you, whenever something blindsides you, really consider if it really did blindside you. <clears throat> and yes, Alphys, I did hear something. Oh no. I'm not doing Madison's voice either. At least not while he's in robot form. Welcome, beauties. To today's quiz show! Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show! Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. Ever play before, Gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die. I'm not good at quizzing. I do like this song though. Hmm. Let's start with an easy one. Uh. Ow. Oh God. Oh, I fucked up. I know this. It's... Uh, let's spare. What are robots made of? And yes, I know that Alphys is helping me. I just kind of brain farted for a second. What? And the quest show continues. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this joke? Correct, you're lucky today. Am I lucky? A memory game. Oh, it's a frog it. I, mean, I remember the monster, just didn't know that medicine was sure. I actually forgot about this little quiz. I'm pretty sure I can get this one. Um, I would smooch a ghost. Would you smooch a ghost? I mean, you know, if it was family member, like a smooch on the cheek or something, or if it was someone I really like. Some of these really do throw me off. Like, I'm trying to pay attention to Alfie so she can help me, but, like, Alphys, Alfies. I don't know. Don't kill me for this. Yeah, I can't read all that. Part of it's actually being blocked off by the recording equipment, too. Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh, you should have told me. Oh, that's a good question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Okay, so it really does matter, but I'm going to go say... Hmm. You know what? I'll be nice. You're correct. Dr. Alfie has a crush on the unknowable. You see, Alfie believes there's someone out there. Someone watching her. Someone she thinks is cute and interesting. Hello, theoretical person. Dr. Alphys likes you. Too bad you're not real. <laughs> Last laugh track. <laughs> hey, I'm research. I'll research about this. There are alternate universes out there. I still can't read it because of the thing, but... Someday, I could meet them. You said the exact same thing about Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. But I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Person, if you're out there, how about giving us a sign right now? <coughs> that settles it. 
That's still sad, doesn't it? Well, you know, we can't really talk about Gaster, because it's rude to talk about someone who's here. Oh, if Dr. Asuki is helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this is just a pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Oh god, he went off the game! Well, oh, certainly something. Can I go through this hole? Space behind the wall has only a few feet wide. Well, I'm going. Uh. Alfie's, I have no health items. Oh, phone number then. Maybe if you need help, I could. But where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It doesn't even have texting. But wait a second, please. Why does someone have to scream for the phone to be upgraded? It can do texting, items, it's got a keychain. He even signed me up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. So I'm going to phone Papyrus and <laughs> Undyne. You're at Alfie's lab? Is she there? Hey, tell her I said hi, okay? And tell me how she's doing. And tell me if she needs anything. And wait, no. Don't ask any of that. Scandalous. It's a computer. It's actually some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. Seems like a rock through to a game, or... <gasps> it's a beat-up figure of a female human with cat ears. Fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Yes. I got instant noodles. What? I can't take more noodles? If at least let me get a soda. Actually, I will let you guys off because I have to actually end the episode right now. I want to thank you all for watching, though. I hope you enjoyed. That was a fun little bit. If I had paid more attention to Alfie, so I'm not taking that damage and risk my life because that was the stupidest thing I've done. I entirely forgot. I entirely forgot. That was so bad. I almost I would have died to Metaton. I don't know if you can die to Metaton like that, but I, I might have. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.